guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sherry and if you're new to this channel, welcome. And as you can see in our ingredients, we're going to be baking egg pie. So egg pie is a very, very, very um, nice and sweet dessert that all Filipinos love. So I'm craving for it guys. So I thought I'll bake one. <laughs> so this vlog is just to just inspire you guys on um, do more baking and whatever you like uh, to do, be it uh, adventure or be it a new hobby, just go for it. Um, so without further ado, we'll get this video started. Regions that we're going to be needing for our filling are flour, salt, butter, sugar, and some cold water that we're going to be needing for the filling are vanilla extract condensed milk evaporated milk and five eggs as i said the the complete measurement for all the ingredients would be listed on the description box down below so on our electric mixer guys we're just gonna combine our dry ingredients first we're gonna put the flour first and then the salt and then the sugar and we're going to combine our butter that's been cut in cubes it doesn't really matter if you don't have a electric mixer you could just use it by you could just mix it by a spoon a wooden spoon or you could mix it by hand so it doesn't really matter if you don't have an electric mixer guys so i'll just turn this on and then on like a low setting and then wait for it to be fully combined once it's combined we could add the water gradually Butter is mixed. We're just gonna form it into a bowl using our hands. Make sure that our hands are clean. And we're going to just refrigerate this for half an hour until it's formed again. So we've got a bowl already. I'm just gonna put it in the fridge for half an hour. It's already been half an hour since we've put our pastry in the fridge so we're just gonna just put some flour on our clean surface and then we're ready to, to roll our pastry guys so we're just gonna just make sure that it's a round round shape and then with the rolling pin we're just gonna be approximately rolling it to the size of our pan just gonna gently roll this guys until just gonna gently roll this and put it on our pan okay so on our pan we're just gonna just slowly lay it down oh. and just Press against the corner so it's got a nice corner to it. Whatever's left on the edge, we're just gonna just trim it, guys. We're just gonna trim it on the corner. Just trim it like that with our fingers. I think I'm gonna just. With other with other pastries, um, with with other pastry containers, you have to pinch it on the side. This one has already got a ridge to it, so I don't need to I don't need to like 
do too much of the pinching. Just pinch it from the corner so that it's a lovely edge to it. So once our crust is ready, we're going to just put this in the fridge while we're preparing our filling. While we're waiting for our pastry batter to harden up on the fridge, we're going to heat our condensed milk, just one cup of it. We're not going to use all the what's in the can, we're just going to use one cup of it. And we're going to be putting this in the microwave for one minute. While I'm heating up my milk, I've already prepared the four eggs. The fifth egg, we're going to be separating them. We're going to be using the white separately. And then the yolk, we're going to combine it to the four eggs that we already have early on. In a large mixing bowl, we're going to be mixing our eggs together, together with our condensed milk. We're also going to put our one teaspoon of vanilla extract. Just gonna mix this all together guys until they're well blended it's like a taste of um, I don't know if you've tasted like um, leche flan in the Philippines the top of it, the topping of it is like leche flan it tastes really nice and it's got a, a pastry base into it so I'm looking forward to how it's gonna turn up. I hope you're excited as I am. <laughs> so with this, I think this is all blended. We're going to put our lukewarm evaporated milk already in the mixture. Just gonna put it gradually. and in a separate mixing bowl the one egg white that we've separated early on in the fifth egg we're just gonna whisk it with an electric mixer until it's formed into soft peaks that would and then we could incorporate it into our mixture it would have that brown effect on the egg pie later on on the while I'm mixing all these ingredients, guys, I've already preheated my oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit or 170 degrees Celsius. So once our egg white has formed into soft peaks already, we're ready to fold it into our filling. I'm just gonna gently fold this in. Our mixture is ready to be poured in into our pastry. We're just gonna just pour it gradually, really, really slowly. Once it's all mixed, 
We're going to be putting it in our oven for 40 to 45 minutes until the tester comes out dry. After 45 minutes guys, our egg pie is ready and this is really really good for uh, merienda. This is really good with a nice hot drink. So I'm so ready and excited to try this. So let's dig in. Now time for the taste test. It's really nice. It's really nice. I really, really recommend it for you guys to try. It's really, really creamy and soft. So until next time, thank you so much for watching this video. And um, don't forget, always be a reason for somebody to have a smile on their faces. So until the next time, happy baking. Take care. Bye.